What are you watching, dear? Oh, Dad, I'm watching a documentary about different regions of the world. Oh, that's good. Dad, I'm surprised to know about polar regions and deserts. Oh, really? But why? Dad, polar regions have extremely cold conditions and deserts have extremely hot temperature. It would be so hard for any animal to live in such adverse conditions. Friends, like Bunty, you must have also wondered that how different animals exist in such extreme temperatures, hot or cold. Let us find out the answer for this query. Friends, different places on the earth are inhabited by different animals. The types of animals that exist differ from place to place. For instance, polar bears or penguins are found in extremely cold polar regions. While in extremely hot deserts, animals like camel and ostrich are found. Different animals have specific body features and habits that make it comfortable for them to exist in their habitats. These specific features and habits are called adaptations. Let us learn about the adaptations of animals living in extremely cold regions and deserts. The polar regions of the earth are covered with ice all through the year. Polar bear lives in North Polar or Arctic region, while penguin lives in South Polar or Antarctic region. Let us see how these animals are able to exist in extremely cold conditions. The white and hollow fur of the body of the polar bear traps air inside them. Beneath the hollow fur, a thick fat layer is present. These body features keep the bear's body warm and enable it to exist in very low temperature. Look at the long, stiff hairs between the pads of bear's feet. These hairs help bear to walk on the cold, slippery ice and swim in cold and icy water. These hairs also enable polar bear to swim and catch seals underwater when ice melts in warmer months. During extremely cold months, Polar bears save energy by sleeping roughly 18 to 20 hours every day. Now let us see how penguins live comfortably in the Antarctic regions. Like the polar bears, they also have thick layer of feathers and layer of fat under the skin. This adaptation keeps the penguins warm. In addition, penguins have flipper-like wings, webbed feet and pointed body shape. These body features make penguins excellent swimmers. They catch fish and feed on them. Now, let us see how animals like camel live comfortably in hot and dry conditions of a desert. In deserts, during daytime, temperature rises to high level, which turns the ground and sand on it very hot. The camel has long legs that keep its body much above the hot sand. Camel has large padded feet, in which toes are joined together. This prevents the feet from sinking into the sand and enables a camel to walk smoothly on the sand. Sandy strong winds are very common in the deserts. A camel has long eyelashes that protects eyes. Moreover, camel can close or open its nostrils during a sandstorm. In favourable conditions, when plenty of food and water is present, camel eats and drinks a lot. Have you noticed the hump on the back of this camel? Excess amount of food is converted into fat and stored in this hump. When food is scarce, camel uses this fat to survive. Camel can live without food and water supply for several days.